Hello. Now we are finished with the verbs. We can begin the links in French. In French, we have some links to pronounce some words, some sentences in French. An example. He has got a cat. Il a un chat. Question. Has he got a cat? In French. The question. Has he got a cat? The question. A. A-t-il un chat? This T. It's to pronounce the sentence. A-t-il un chat? No. A-t-il un chat? Another example for um, to understand that in French there are some links. It's to say, for example, I have got some uh, some cakes. Give me one, please. Give me one. Give me some. Give me some. So in French, a link. J'ai des gâteaux. J'ai des gâteaux. Donne-en moi. Give me some. Donne-en moi. Ou, ou bien. Or. Oh. Donne-moi. Zan. Donne-moi zan, donne-en moi. En rapport report des gâteaux. In order to 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 do not say donne-moi des gâteaux. I know that I have some cakes. I know that you have some cakes. So give me one. Give me some. Dans en moi. I know that you have got some cakes. It's not. It's not usual to say another one. Donne moi des gâteaux. I have some cakes. Dans en moi. Un autre exemple. Another example. In French, we have some links. En rapporte au gâteau. Donc, il y a en qui rapporte, report, en et i. Il y a un chat. Il y a un chat. Pourquoi i Ici, ici il y a un chat. Ici, here. Ici. So, he report to ici. So,
So, another example. It's difficult. For, for, it's a difficult language. I know it. But I try to help you. Um... Je suis allé à Marseille. I have gone to Marseille. J'y suis réponse. First sentence, second sentence, ask. J'y suis déjà already. I have already gone to Marseille. J'y suis déjà allé. He report to Marseille. It's very strange to say Marseille, je suis déjà allé. No. J'y suis déjà allé. Je suis allé à Marseille. J'y suis déjà allé. Here's the links. And the report. 